I'm Dr. Peggy Wallace, and I'm a professor of molecular genetics and microbiology at the University of Florida College of Medicine. After I got my PhD in medical genetics at Indiana University, I took a postdoctoral position with Dr. Francis Collins at the University of Michigan, where he was an assistant professor, and he was working on this new cutting edge area called positional gene cloning. Um, he's the one who chose the NF1 project for me, but I was very interested in it because I had seen patients with NF1 in my graduate work. She has really helped the foundation and is helping the foundation tremendously. Working with Peggy Wallace is a breath of fresh air. I think of Peggy as a, uh, as a humble facilitator of other people's success. Best thing about Peggy has been her sustainability in the NF field. Through her efforts at sharing resources for people to add to their own science. She is completely transparent. She is completely generous. If she creates a new data set or a new tool, she works to get it out to the community as fast as she can. And through her efforts at mentorship of young investigators and facilitating uh, the process of the Young Investigator Award. The main contribution that she has made to the scientific realm has been the Schwann cells that have been derived from the tumors, from both plexiform as well as MPNST, that are still being used and are discussed now in our NF conference. One of the other ways that I fight NF actually is because I'm in touch with a lot of research subjects, they also sometimes ask me clinical questions. Now, I'm not a physician, but I know a lot of physicians who are very good at NF uh, work, and so I can help refer them or I can ask questions on their behalf. And so one of the, my favorite things to do is help make sure that some of these people actually get the right kinds of care that they're supposed to through connections. And in fact, what is unique about Peggy is that she is always building bridges, making connections, making sure that NF awareness is raised and that people that don't know NF actually get access to somebody who really knows NF. So if I would have to summarize Peggy in three words, I think my three words for Peggy are smart, humble, and passionate. Funny and fun-loving and a bit irreverent and completely committed to the people living with NF and the Children's Tumor Foundation. And I'm so excited that Peggy is winning this award this year because if there is one person that deserves it, it's Peggy. I love coaxing the genome into giving up its secrets. Mm -hmm.